All right, you guys, this is game time. This is so fun. Okay, so this is within the Miro mind maps. This is the weekly Big Five leadership team. And wanted to jump in. This is the, uh, this is basically the goals. When we have a goal, we put it right in here. This is the Monday list. So we're all gonna have five. We put five in here and have a list of 25 and um or however many yeah we're gonna have a big list here so we put the, those in here monday first thing and then um and then as it moves along we then assign a project to ourselves within our asana and then we break that down into baby steps along the way um before we actually do the thing, uh, that's why uh, before we do the thing, we want to break it down in Asana, uh, so that way we're working smart. And then, and then finally, when we're in progress, we can finally move it here. So, pretty simple. Like to move these things, you just drag it to the to the next one over, and then just plop it wherever it goes. Let's say it's Wednesday, and. Um, you know, um, are we on track on Wednesday? We want to see that not only is it in progress, but let's let's bring it on over to see if we're really on track or not. So this is the this is the game board basically. Now, once we're done, let's say client onboarding project that's done. That can then go into our our touchdown. This is a touchdown, which which is the done for the week. As soon as that's done, it goes there. Now if you take a look here, we can see progress. So we got, um, this is just going to start over in May, but I put this uh, tentatively, I'm just throwing on um, some fake numbers here, but these are points. If we were to get points, touchdowns, you get a point for every touchdown. So lots of opportunities within a full month. This one's two months because April's already gone, but we could restart this every quarter. And we can just keep track and just see, kind of have fun with it to see that we're making touchdowns. So this would be the touchdown thing. This is starting, this starts over each month. And so, um, so these are all gonna, we're just gonna start deleting anything from this as you, as the month um, passes so that'll be our kind of a recap for the month so we got our our week recap here and then we've got our um, continuing month recap here and obviously we want from our week we want to add to the to the month's achievements but w what um, this game requires is this game is going to require us to be very specific because we have to know um, if we are making progress or if it's even something that is attainable. So for example, one year vision or three year vision or security policy, for example, that's not specific enough to say, yep, I'm done with it this week. We got to have some specific, uh, measurable. So it's like the smart goals, right? So we know we can be okay. Distinctly that is done because I know it looks like this or whatever. So you know, um, so for example, let's say we want to do Slack setup. So this is just the basic setup of Slack. Now, none of these are actually really good examples. None of these are like amazing, but I want to show you that, um, right here, one thing that can really help us to know whether or not we're writing it in a form that is clearly achievable is whether or not we're using past tense. So um, past tense is really helpful because it helps us also to know, um, to kind of keep it in mind, like, okay, so if I was to achieve this, like how, how was it achieved? Right? So we ask ourselves, so, you know, Slack is set up, is all set up, right? So that's what I want to be able to say at the end of the week. And I know it's all set up, because 
uh, I was able to break it down. You know, how was I able to get to the Slack was all set up? Well, I can break those down into steps. Now, I'm, I'm personally not really great at doing this, so this is good practice for me um, to hold myself accountable to this. So, um, so jumping over here, rule number one right here, um, they need to be smart goals. So we all agree to look over our weekly big five, which is this whole thing, right? We all agree to look over that, this whole thing, the, the whole game, and put any other's goals into the penalty box that aren't specific enough. So we need to be very specific and we're gonna just all hold each other. Like Bruce said, we all hold each other's feet to the fire and that's accountability. And so right here, so we all agree to look over these and put any others in the, this penalty box. So somebody writes down one vision, it's like, okay, we're not, you know, or three year or, or whatever, one year, that's not gonna be good enough. So I'm just gonna place it right there. Boom, that's in the penalty box. And it can't get out of the penalty box until it, meet, it meets the SMART goal requirements basically rule number one and rule number two. So start over right here. It needs to be specific, measurable, attainable, realistic, and time that it's due. So smart, right? Time. So it needs to have a, a due date on it. So for example, this one here is a lot is better because this one has um, Dina on here. So add assignee. So if I was to add an assignee, pick whoever, you know, and then it puts that person on there. And if I want to put a date, there's the date right there. So if I was to do the same here, you just add a signee right there, or you set the date that you want it to be done. Obviously, we're doing uh, five day sp sprints. So we're hoping to get these done by Friday. So, um, so right here, so it needs to be specific. What, what needs to be specific about it? It needs to have a specific person assigned. It needs to be like, you know, more than just, you know, positions, vision, like what does that mean, right? It needs to be measurable. So it's like, okay, how do we know when this is actually done? Uh, attainable, so we don't wanna like, be like, oh, I'm gonna author a book by this Friday, right? <laughs> and, um, and also we want something to kind of stretch us and then, or, you know, whatever. Um, and then realistic, so that's the attainable and the realistic type thing. And then the time, so it's gotta have a, a date associated with when we want it done. So this is the game time. This is, this is how we get points. And this just kinda help us all hold each other accountable. And I'm gonna end up deleting basically all of these things because they're not, um, they, they don't meet these rules and we can kind of just start fresh this next Monday and then we'll all delete all of these as well. We just kind of start over and just have fun with this. It's more just like a fun, like here's what's going on. It's a visual representation of our five minute um, thing that we're going to talk about every Sunday or no, every Monday and then every, so every Monday right there and then every Wednesday, five minutes, five minutes. So here's here's the thing, and then here's where I'm at with it. And then we can kind of visually see, like, you know, and maybe maybe we're not on track to hitting it. And if we're not on track, maybe we need to um, rely on other people or, you know, be like, hey, you know, this is a little bit too big of a goal. I need to break it down a little bit, a little bit more. And we just readjust. So let me know what you think. Um, about this game time. This is the weekly big five leadership team. And as we click on it, we'll, it'll, it'll show this frame here, this game time frame. And then we'll just start this next week uh, to get some points. So that's right here, weekly big five. And uh, let me know, let me know if you all, what you think about it, if you agree with it, if you think we need to um, adjust those rules if it needs to be different, but we all need to agree on a leadership, um, you know, way of, of going about moving things forward, moving this needle uh, forward. So, sounds good. Talk to you soon. Please uh, let me know as many 
thoughts you have if you want to throw down another rule up here if you want to you know if you want to change something maybe maybe like if you have questions you could even like you know right write down some questions that you, that you have or or ideas or we can just talk about it on the phone so all right guys